welcome to our morning routine with a six month old in an RV. In case you were ever curious what it's like having a baby in an RV and what our morning routine would look like, I'm gonna show you right now. So our day starts out and we wake up and the first thing we do is open up the blinds um, in our bedroom area of the RV and then we lay back down because it is very early when Snow wakes up and of course she's our alarm clock and we like to just kind of cuddle with her and just slowly wake up and take our time because it is gorgeous where we're staying. We're actually staying in Folsom Lake and as you guys can see and we'll show you more a little bit later in this video of the surroundings in the area, it's just gorgeous. So uh, we like to, like I said, take our time waking up and really just be obsessed with our daughter because <laughs> she's just the cutest thing to us. And for most of you guys that know that I've watched our channel for a while, it took us a really long time to get snow here. Uh, we actually did IVF to have her because we struggled with infertility and so now after four long years she's finally here and we are so obsessed with her she is just our whole world and so as you can probably see that in our past videos and even in this video we're obsessed with our daughter we really like to do everything we can to spend as much time as we possibly can with her So eventually we end up getting out of bed and the first thing I do is make the bed. I don't always do this at home. By the way, I hope just to clarify that people know we don't live in our RV. Although we have nothing against living in our RV. I think that'd be so awesome to do, but um, this is just, you know, a vacation for us. But I always make the bed because when we're in our RV, it's such a small space and so you really have to keep things neat. Um, also, fun fact, this campground is totally haunted. I feel like I should do a story time on this because so many weird things happened to us and it wasn't even at nighttime. It was during the day, like why we were filming this. It was so creepy, but anyway, that's besides the point. So after I clean up the motorhome, I then brush my teeth and Snow absolutely loves when I brush my teeth. I don't know what it is, but I think she just likes looking at the toothbrush or something. So I always like to hold her when I'm brushing my teeth. Uh, and then I will hand her off to Travis so that I can do more stuff to get ready in the morning. Uh, so he'll play with her and hang out in our little sitting area. That's Miss Peacock. It's like her favorite toy. Um, if any of you guys are wondering about Bandit, who is our cat, he is at home and we have a house sitter. Then I'll wash my face and brush my hair, throw some chapstick on. Can we peep that postpartum hair loss though? Girl, I'm telling you, it's falling out everywhere. And I actually put makeup on for this video and so I'll show you how I do makeup when I'm in the RV and um, you know with a baby and also breastfeeding because that's another thing that I'm doing <laughs> that can um, take time and sometimes you know you have to multitask as a mom. So that was our fancy little way of showing you guys us changing from our pajamas into regular clothes. Um, and I do have my uh, makeup done already, but we'll rewind here in a second and I'll show you kind of how I do it. But oh my gosh, Snow, she's just so cute. So I was nursing and doing my makeup at the same time. Um, and this is kind of how I do my makeup and where I do my makeup when we're in the motorhome. Um, so I will kind of just do it in the place that has like the best natural lighting and use a little mirror. Uh, and then I bring really just that small little makeup bag when I travel and I'll show you some of the things that are in it in a second. Uh, I'm still breastfeeding, going strong. <laughs> She's had like nursing strikes and all kinds of issues, but um, we've been powering through it. These are some of the products that I like and really um, love to use. Obviously, my makeup. So 
So next up is breakfast, and I have oatmeal every single morning, and so I am just going to get ready to make myself some oatmeal, and then I will show you what I make for my husband. So next I will make a tofu scramble for my husband. Normally he does not do microwave meals, uh, but because we're in the RV and we're camping, it was an exception. So I just put this in the microwave for like four minutes. It has 22 grams of protein, I think. So uh, it's actually really, really good too. Uh, so I just make us some breakfast, you know, easy stuff. And then we sit down at the table and enjoy our breakfast. So then once we're done eating breakfast, we make our coffee. I know it's kind of backwards. I think most people drink their coffee first and then have breakfast, but we like to drink our coffee after breakfast. Let me know down in the comment section, do you guys drink your coffee before breakfast or after breakfast? I'm curious. So once our coffee is made, we go ahead and we sit down at our table and just enjoy our coffee. This is the time I'll probably go through social media, uh, respond to comments, uh, respond to some DMs and, you know, check YouTube comments, you know, the whole social media thing. And then I always FaceTime my mom. We FaceTime my mom like three times a day so she can see snow. <laughs> uh, so we do that often. And then I'll wash dishes and just clean up the rest of the motorhome. And then I will have a little playtime with snow and just show her lots of love and attention. And I try to do this as much as I can throughout the day. Uh, and she is just everything to me. I uh, I can't even tell you. I've never been more in love with anyone in my whole entire life. I love my daughter so much. Travis is being a wonderful husband and taking the trash out. And <laughs> these are some fancy shots of him throwing the trash away. I don't know why we decided to add that in. But I don't know. In case you wanted to see my husband taking the trash out. There you go. And then it was such a gorgeous, gorgeous day out that we wanted to go explore. One thing that I love, oh my gosh, that face. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me, Al? Uh, that's what Travis likes to say all the time. His cat jokes. <laughs> she loves to lick the side of the carrier to like chew on it. I think she's teething. So uh, I, what I was going to say is one great thing about being in the RV is it really kind of forces us to be outdoors and outside more. Um, I'm such a homebody, so it's nice to be able to go explore. So we decided to go head out to the lake and take a little walk around with Snow Bear and the carrier. And it was just really nice, you guys. It was like romantic to spend time with my husband. I loved having, oh my gosh, that sign was awesome, that welcome camper sign. Um, I just loved having the baby and just being outdoors and it was just such a nice day. And so we really, really love, love, love having our RV. It's been like a dream of ours to do something like this for so long, like since we were little. So we feel really grateful that we are able to have it. And Travis remodeled the whole inside of it and we'll do a whole like remodel 
update and everything soon, but we kind of just wanted to share our morning routine with you guys, and it doesn't stop there. Oh no, there's more. <laughs> I feel like one of those like sales um, TV shows, like, but wait, there's more. Uh, so I, like I said, have to keep this space really clean. So every single day when we're in the motorhome, I'm vacuuming. Uh, it doesn't take long because it's a very small space, but um, this Dyson vacuum is amazing. I would highly recommend it. Uh, my husband tried to get me to not buy it, but I bought it anyways, and I'm so glad that I did. It was totally worth it. Uh, it's great for the motorhome. But like I said, because it's such a small space, it gets dirty really fast, and so you kind of just have to keep up on, you know, keeping it clean, but... Uh, you know, again, multitasking with the baby. Welcome to like mom life or parent life. So yeah, just cleaning up the RV and then that kind of like wraps up our morning routine. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Thank you guys again so much for watching and supporting our channel. We are sending you all of our love and all of our positive energy and we hope to see you in our next video.